Do you have CDs, cassettes, or vinyl that you're looking to sell directly to your fans through your website? Today we're learning how to set up your physical albums for sale using our store feature. To get started with physical album sales, we'll click on our edit content tab here. Click the pages button here on the left to select the page you'd like to add the album to, or create a new page for it. Now click add feature and select the store feature. Place it on the page using the placement arrows seen here. Now you'll want to click on add product and select the type of physical release you want to sell from the drop down menu here. This is where you'll want to associate the physical album with a digital one. You can select from a digital album you've already created on your site or click the create a new album link to set it up now. Once this step is complete and you've either selected an existing album or created a new one, you'll find yourself on the product creation screen. This is where you'll create the physical product associated with the digital album you just selected. Then enter the product name and description here. This is where you can attach an image to display with the store item. It could be the album artwork, or a photo of the physical album, or an icon image. Under status, you can choose from three different settings. Available will make it available for purchase right away. Not available will display the product on your site, but visitors won't be able to add it to their shopping cart. Hidden will make it so that the product won't display on your website, but will be saved on your account for use later on when you're ready. Under pricing, you have three options to choose from as well. Free means that anyone can add it to their cart and check out with their shipping information without needing to pay for it. Fixed price allows you to enter a set price for the album and fan set price lets the buyer decide how much they wanna pay. Enter your set price here or a minimum price if you have the fans set price option enabled. If on the pro plan, you'll be able to set the album for sale at a discounted price. This will display the original price as well as the reduced sale price next to it as a way to entice visitors to buy. If you're using our integration with TaxJar to add tax to your customers' purchases at checkout, this is where you can select the tax category to use. If you're not intending on charging tax, then you can skip this field. This toggle lets you set whether or not you want to include the digital copy of the download with the purchase of the physical one. If this is turned on, anyone buying the physical album will be sent an email with the digital download after checkout. Turning on Allow Direct Linking will let people easily share your product on their social media or share a direct link to it with somebody. Turning this off will remove any share links from the product on your store page. Here under Free Download, you can attach a track or a file to be sent to the purchaser after checkout. The Pro Plan also allows you to track inventory. Enter the number of physical copies you have available to sell, and the store product will automatically be set to not available, out of stock, once this number is reached. The shipping controls are where you can decide whether or not you want to add a shipping fee to the cost of your album at checkout. This can be turned on or off here. The shipping cost drop-down menu lets you select between a custom shipping rate or have EasyPost calculate the rate for you. To learn more about what EasyPost is and how to use them with your store, click the link to the video in the description below. If using a custom shipping price, you'll want to enter a cost for the first item, as well as a price for additional items. This means if someone purchases more than one of the same album, you can charge them nothing or a lesser cost for shipping each additional copy added to the order. You can also add an international shipping surcharge. This amount will be added to the shipping price for any orders outside of your home country. The weight and handling surcharge fields are only necessary if using EasyPost. You can learn more about these fields in the EasyPost walkthrough video below. The upsell option, available on the Pro Plan, allows you to select up to three other products from your store that you'd like to recommend to purchasers at checkout. Upselling is a great way to offer other albums, digital downloads, or other merch items along with the album sale. Click Save Product and you're all done. We hope you're enjoying your commission-free merch store on your website powered by Ben Zugel.